Hey everyone, uh, it's about a half hour before we have to leave for Mozzie's um, ultrasound and I thought I'd jump on here before um, we go and and uh, tell you how miserable Mozzie has been because he has not been able to eat breakfast, his dental bone, his lunch. These boys are upset too because they don't have their lunch yet. When we leave, my son's gonna feed them their lunch. Um, Cause I felt horrible. I felt just horrible not feeding Mozzie his breakfast this morning. <laughs> I put him in the bedroom in his crate, um, turned on a fan really loud, and was hoping he didn't hear me feeding the other boys. I'm sure he did. I'm sure he knew what was going on. But I felt so bad not feeding him his breakfast. And about 11 o'clock, they start begging for their dental bone. And he just don't understand what's going on. No, he doesn't. I caught him out there eating a little bit of grass. I hope that don't affect anything when he has his uh, ultrasound. His, uh, when he gets, I believe they're putting him um, under anesthesia. So, since he can't eat. So, yeah. So, it's about, it's 1.40. We're leaving about 2.10. So... All right, guys, we will be back later on today and let you know um, how it went. Okay, guys, we are back from the ultrasound. We've been back a little bit. Um, we ate dinner and um, fed Mozzie, and he's happy now and relaxed. <laughs> He was frantic about why he wasn't um, being fed today. So, yes, he's happy he got to finally eat. And now he can take a little snooze. So, like I said, we're back from the ultrasound. And the ultrasound findings were no masses, no tumors, liver looked great, adrenal glands looked great, everything looked great except for the gallbladder. Um, let me read this here. It's very small um, print, so I'm going to read it without showing it because um, my camera may have a hard time picking it up. So I will show you Mozzie relaxing here as I read it. Okay. And, and I'm sorry if I, if I miss, if I don't know how to say something, a word, if I say it wrong, I'm going to pop it up on the screen <laughs> if I can't pronounce it. Okay. Abdominal ultrasound demonstrated moderate sludge in the gallbladder. These findings could be consistent, uh, consistent cholestasis, which means thickened bile, or an early gallbladder mucosal. Um, your sedial has been prescribed to try and make the bile more liquefied so it can move out of the gallbladder. A recheck ultrasound and blood work is recommended in four weeks. It says monitor for any vomiting, diarrhea, anorexia, abdominal pain, or any other problems. So, along with the um, uracidal Dial. I will pop it up on the screen, you guys. They also prescribed him some more uh, Denimarin. So, um, so Uracidial and Denimarin. They want him to take that. I think they prescribed. I think they prescribed thirty days worth. Yes, thirty days worth because they want him back in four weeks to do another ultrasound. Um, so, this is what he's taking. And let me show the um, prices for everything because I know some of you are curious about that. Okay, so the um, internal medicine exam slash consultation was $100. The ultrasound of the abdomen was $340. The... Uracidial was 45 and then the Denimarin was 125 which I know a lot of you told me you can get the Denimarin on uh, Amazon, but I need him to start this right away, so there was no waiting for a couple days for the Denimarin. If I do have to continue to give this to him, 
I will purchase it on Amazon and not pay $125. Uh, dollars. <laughs> but this is what I had to pay right now. So our total was $610. And as they were ringing us up, my husband wrote this um, to show what just the medicine <laughs> cost. So we have a tentative um, uh, appointment for June 10th, 815. They want me to call back on the 3rd because they're not sure if they want him to come back in right the next day that his medicine is um over just in case he has to continue on a medication so they don't want it to stop and then have to start back up again. So a tentative appointment for June 10th at 8.15 a.m. to have another ultrasound done and that will be another $440 and possibly maybe have to take more medication. And they said if the if this does not clear up, um, that they would probably recommend getting his gallbladder removed. So please everybody say a prayer that these medications work because they estimated getting his gallbladder removed at $3,500 to $4,500. So, so please, yes, please, everybody say a prayer. If we all pray together and send good thoughts to Mozzie, hopefully this medication will clear it up. She said this may be something he may have to take forever. Um, it may be something he just has to take for a couple months and then uh, just have another recheck. So who knows how many ultrasounds we're going to have to pay for, but um, uh, it may clear up and then he won't have to take it anymore. It's just kind of a wait and see um, with it. So yeah, so I was so happy. Like the hugest weight came off my shoulders when she said there were no masses and no signs of tumors. Oh my goodness, guys. I was like, yes, <laughs> I can breathe now again. And I mean, if he has to have his gallbladder out and we have to spend the money, then so be it. At least this isn't a life threatening, um, Thing going on. It's something that can be taken care of. And I am so relieved and I am so happy. Um, so happy. Whew. So yes, let's pray though. That he doesn't have to have surgery because I I'd hate for him to have to have uh, surgery and have that removed. But, um, I want to thank everybody again. I'm sorry. I'm tearing up. Oh, I'm, and I'm and not because I'm sad or anything. It's because I'm just so happy and I'm so relieved. Um, I was so scared we were going to come home and have to give you guys bad news. <laughs> and uh, I'm just so happy that it's uh, nothing too, too serious. I'm just so happy. <sighs> so I want to thank you guys again for all your love and support and all your comments. I just, I just... All your comments mean so much to me. So thank you guys again. And um, hopefully in a couple days, we'll have a more uh, uplifting and fun video to share. <laughs> this video is uplifting and, and great news to you, but you know what I mean. Okay, guys, I will talk to you later. And I'm going to enjoy the rest of the evening um, stress-free. <laughs> All right, guys, we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.